welcome. I'm Brent. You're watching Steam Culture. We're going to be talking about cotton this week. You know, it is the fabric of our lives. In fact, if you want to have fancy looking clothes like this guy, you got to have cotton. Now, I want to tell you about a particular cotton mill, and it's in England. And it is the last, or it was the last, operating steam cotton mill in the world. It's the Queen Street Cotton Mill, and it's in England, and it last operated in 1982. Significant because it was the last steam-powered cotton mill operating in the world. Now, it was reopened by some folks that said, you know what, this is significant. We want the public to see it, which is very cool. So it reopened somewhere in the 1990s. Now, the, the, the plant was operated by two Lancashire boilers. You'll see in the image, the unique design is that they have two flues in the boiler, produced about 100 PSI of steam, burned about six tons of coal a day. Now, that steam was going to a double-acting compound steam engine. What that means is that they're using the steam twice. As it goes through the first cylinder and acts on the piston, on both sides of the piston, it gives up some energy, but not all of it. So they exhaust it, go to a second cylinder where it acts at a lower pressure. So you have the high pressure cylinder and the low pressure cylinder. And at that point, they exhaust the steam because it's given up most of its energy. Now that, that engine was used to turn 308 looms. And you can see here in the video, it's quite the process, pretty impressive to see. If you're ever over in England, go see the Queen Street Cotton Mill. Or you could just Google it like I did. But before you do that, Google us because we have great content for you each and every week. I'm gonna go right now and work on something for you for next week. Have a great weekend.